Good afternoon, friends. In the series of my techniques, talking to you in the, my techniques of writing or the art of writing, I feel that writing is intimidating to a lot of people, particularly those who don't uh, uh, write for a living or on a regular basis. The good news is that writing doesn't have to be agonizing and almost anybody can improve their writing skill with a little discipline and a willingness to learn. You want to become a, a, a better writer? There are always a self-improving techniques or skills we can write, you can just learn. So today I'm going to just talk on, uh, uh, less about me and more about your writing skills. And I say very succinctly and explicitly that first thing you want to be a writer, just sit down and start writing something. Every day, pick a topic or pick something that happens to you that you would like to clarify to get off your uh, chest. Writing clarifies thinking. My friend, it also... Uh, creates a freedom for additional thoughts when the idea is down on a paper is no longer uh, it, it no longer clutters your mind it's the uh, same with thoughts the same with the uh, stories writing memorizes clarifies and clears at the same time Capture your best thought and ideas. Uh, the second they occur. When you get an idea, one thought, uh, it tends to lead to another. They come quickly and they exit just as quickly. The faster you capture, the more complete the idea will be. Write the ideas down on anything, but always be ready to transfer the thoughts onto your laptop or computer on the screen. This will allow you to uh, reread, edit, expand and perceive your thoughts forever. Even preserve your thoughts forever. Write, write it like you would say it. Speak onto your uh, computer and speak to yourself as you write. The more complete thought. Many people fight uh, with their words if you write uh, like you speak you will never be at your uh, uh, at a loss of words you will also never suffer from the myth known as the writer's block make sure your thoughts are, are simple easy to understand and complete as you're writing make certain that you put down everything that is on your mind and when you're editing or rereading read it as though it were a story that you would uh, not have to expand, explain to anyone if they are reading it. My friend, remember, edit early and often. The moment you finish writing, sit back and reread what you have what you have wrote uh, uh, wrote at top of top from top to bottom. Errors will be apparent after you finish the first edit. Let your writing uh, sit for at least a day. After you have edited your own piece twice, uh, give it to someone else you like uh, uh, or you trust or like that person. Someone who will give you objective, honest feedback. Editing will also be lead to additional thoughts, my friends. You are writing for uh, the reader. And you're not writing for yourself. Brush up your basics before you get down to writing. It's very important. Before you can start writing uh, incredible content, you will need to at least have uh, intermediate understanding or the basic principles of writing. Write like it's your job. If you want to get better at something, you have to practice. And writing is no exception, my friend.
unfortunately there are a few shortcuts that can transform you onto an amazing uh, winter overnight. And even the more talented writers have to learn their craft over a period of uh, many years. If you want to improve your writing skill, writing on a regular basis will not only diminish your fear of the uh, blank piece or blinking, uh, uh, blinking cursor, or it will also help you to develop a unique style of your own. So even if nobody reads it, keeps writing. Practice always makes man perfect. Find a writing partner if you can. If you work at a reasonably uh, uh, sized company, the chances are pretty good that there is at least one other person who is also uh, wondering how to become a better writer. Although writing is typically considered a solitary activity, the best writers know when it's a time to get much needed feedback of their work from their colleagues, from the peers, from the friends. Talk to your co-workers or friend and ask yourself if they would be willing to cast an eye over your work. They make a spot mistake and you overlooked. Finding a writer's partner is also get a great way to hold yourself accountable and continue writing. Keep going. They require join a workshop. The sex writing that you admire. Most people read the same blog or sites on a regular basis because the material appeals to them. The fewer people understand why their favorite uh, blogs are so appealing. Find a handful of recent blogs posts and you really, you, which you really like, then print them out. Next, just uh, like you have your high school English teacher did, take a red pen and highlight things you uh, liked, certain sentences, turn, turn, <laughs> Even entire paragraphs, examine why you like these elements and see if there are any common threads you uh, favored reading material. See how writers take one subject and transition into another. Apply these techniques to your own work. Imitate writers you admire, my friend. And remember, the outlines, they are your best friends. The blinking cursor of a blank page is considerably uh, an indication that you are writing it well. Before you go any, go any further, a disclaimer, a limitation, you see, or imitation of your favorite writers will help you to improve better and become better. My friend, try these things of tips I've shared with you and practice. I'm sure you'll be a better writer. Thank you very much.